Hi everybody, this is Carrie Gans from Newbie Rewards. That's NewbieRewards.com. Uh, please get over there and try to get one of our free memberships if they're available. If not silver or platinum, there's a, oh, thousands of programs and videos and ebooks and uh, video courses and, and web services, all kinds of things to help you take your online business or your brick and mortar business to a much more successful level. It's everything you need for the internet all in one place. Anyway, so today, instead of a, a plug-in for the day, I wanted to show you how to install a form on the sidebar using widgets. Because someone asked me how to do that, so I figured it's a good thing to show you how to do. Now, I've already created this form in uh, one shopping cart. That's one of, the, um, one of the services I use. You could use AWeber or any of the other autoresponders, but you need to create the form in HTML somewhere else. That's one of the things you just have to do, and you should by now know how to do it. So get over and create your form, you know, the name and the email address and the submit button, all that kind of stuff. And then what you want to do is save the HTML code. It's real simple to do. And I would suggest either one shopping cart, it's a great all-in-one program, or if you're just looking for an autoresponder, then you can certainly use AWeber, which is another program I use. Anyway, so what we're going to do is if you want to install this form on the sidebar, then all you're going to do is go to the side on the left hand side and go to where your widgets are. So you're going to go find your widgets. Where, where did my widgets go? There they are. And you're going to click on widgets. And it's going to help. Oh, I got to sign in again. Don't go anywhere. Well, let's see. I can never remember what the sign in is. Okay, there we are. So now we're in our, the widgets section. I just clicked on widgets. And what I'm going to do is take, if you look on, over here under widgets, there's a box that says text, arbitrary text or HTML. There's the key. What you're going to do is drag it over to, this, over to the widgets and it'll open up. Remember I told you that you, gotta, you have to create your form in either one shopping cart, a web, or one of the other autoresponders. And what you're going to do now is just paste it in here. There's the form. Okay. Now you may have to make some adjustments depending on the, on the size of your sidebar. So you may have to change the size of the text, you may have to change the, the size of the field for the email and for the, uh, for the name, and that's something you may have to play with a little bit. You also have to put a title in, so you can type in, um, please complete, how about this, get your free gift. Okay, and now I'm going to click save. It's important that you remember to click save. You can close the widget. And now, if we go look at the site, we're going to open up our Twitter right site. And with a little bit of luck, on the right hand side, you should see what I just did. Now we'll close this. This is not what we're talking about. So we'll give me a minute here. It's going to take a little bit to load because it's got a lot of videos. We're going to close that window. And if we look all the way at the bottom here, we should see my form. And there it is. Get your free gift. Fill out this form for a free gift and there'll be rewards. Someone can then type in their name, email address, their company, and click submit. If you don't want to put company, don't put company. Whatever you want to put in here is fine. I'm going to actually get rid of the word company because I don't really need that. I just want name and email address. And then you can also put in we respect your privacy because none of us want to really want to give our email address if someone's going to start giving it out. So you want to make sure that you that you do this ethically and you never give away somebody's email address. Anyway, so that's just how to put a form. It's that simple. Uh, once again, I use this is done in one shopping cart. That's oneshoppingcart.com. You can get to it right here, as a matter of fact. Or you can go to AWeber, um, which is another product, another service, and they create the forms as well. Uh, have a great day. Hope you enjoyed it, and go create your form.